salama lai ku mata nan najera i am international aboki i am concerned about what is happening in nigeria kuma i am passionate about this therefore i want to ask every nigeria this question that is begging for an answer i am asking every nigeria including those in power what is the opens of zaibo menene lafi in yamurai what is the opens what has the eagles done what is the opens that every tribe is talking against abo yorubas are spoken against abo my brother the northerners are all talking against abo therefore i am concerned as a nigeria hub house hub abo yes i am hub house hub abo mama na abo my father na hausa he was a soldier during the biafra war and he took my mother and went to kanasta and that was the place he got back to all of us therefore i am concerned what our is happening to Ibo is indirectly affecting as a part of my family as a part of every other person because the Ibo is the strength of this nation wallahi tallahi there is no body in nigeria that is more nigerian or more patriotic than the Ibo Ibo are everywhere in Nigeria, developing everywhere. Ibo is in Kano. He come to Kano, he will buy land, build a house. Have a shop. He will obey the law of the land. He will contribute for the development of the place. The something is what is happening in Lagos. And everywhere, Abuja, Ibo is developed everywhere in Abuja. What is the offense of the Ibo? After the war, we promise that Ibo will not back to no bondage. Let us stay together as one Nigeria. Both the situation in Nigeria, though, is that Ibos are being terribly marginalized. The reason why the issue of Biafra came up again is because the Ibos are not respected, and they have made great contribution in Nigeria. They are the heart, the engine, the control Nigeria. When life will touch Ibo, Nigeria will scatter. Take Ibo away from Nigeria, there will be no Nigeria. It is only Ibo that make embassment in all the places. There is no house in the house in the east. There is no Yoruba in the house in the east. Ama Ibo everywhere. Ibo is one Nigeria in attitude, in character. Ama everybody, all the tribe are hating Ibo for nothing. You are, we are all envious of the Ibo. We are just envious of the Ibo. Because I don't know why we will not apologize to Ibo. Gwawon. Obasanjo. Buhari. You need to apologize to Ibo. Tell Ibo sorry. Beg the Ibo not to go. Because Ibo go. Wallah, I will follow my Oga, I will go is. If Ibo go for Biafra, I will follow Ibo, go Biafra. Without Ibo in Nigeria, there is no Nigeria. And what brought about this agitation for Biafra is because the Ibos are not given their right and their fair share in Nigeria. That is why they are crying and they are complaining, they are agitating for Biafra. Because they are right. You cannot put a child and tell a child not to cry. If we are a doer, we are still alive by now. We are a doer, good man. Good man, we are a doer. Wallah, he would have apologized to Ibo. He would have appealed to the heart of the evil people and begged them not to go. Ama Buhari me Taurenkai. Buhari is very stubborn. He will not hear. You kill Ibo. You kill Ibo every day. You interpret that Ibo. You will not give them their share. They are, they are right. They will continue to agitate for Biafra. I am using this opportunity to appeal to every Nigeria. Appreciate Ibo. Celebrate Ibo. Because without Ibo, Nigeria will be scattered and there will be no Nigeria ever. That is my advice.